What is going on, everybody? It's DGen Rips. We've got some hanger packs of the brand new UFC Optic. This is the first year they've done it, and I'm pretty excited. UFC is some of my favorite stuff to open, just as much as, as football. Really enjoy opening it, and Optic is, is just my favorite product in general. So let's see, I got three hanger packs here. They're a bit expensive, you know, $20 for a hanger. So let's see, it says it comes with Photon Parallels. And uh, I just, I don't know, I was I was looking for some Anderson Silva stuff, just a PC. I've always loved him. He was my favorite fighter to watch ever, by far. Uh, has the most impressive highlight reel. I think he has the most, uh, I mean, he has like a 16 fight win streak. It could be the longest ever. I think John Jones might have passed him, but John Jones has his controversies. Here we go, Yuri, we get, uh, well, he got he got stripped of the belt. But I was just thinking, like, so, oh, why is this UFC down, oh, no, I was going to say, I was like, okay, the UFC logo down there is white. I was like, why is it black? And it's just because he's on the cage, and they were just like, screw it, let's just leave the UFC cage there. But Pantoja, very good fighter, and I was wondering why some UFC autos go for way more than others so Anderson Silva autos who was like the goat they pulled all the fighters in the UFC and asked who the goat was I think Anderson Silva would win and um there's the Dustin Poirier no rookie with that but I think Anderson Silva will win and his autos go for about a quarter as much as Khabib autos go for and uh for, for me that doesn't make much sense like it's a it's a goat Wow, that, that was $20. That was horrible. Not even a single rookie card. I don't know what that was. That was really bad. But, uh, yeah, like I was saying, why is that? In this sport, does Makachev, Patty, you know, even Khabib, why do their stuff go for so much more than GSP, Anderson, even like John Jones? It doesn't make much sense to me. I don't know. But just food for thought. And um, let's get into number two here. Yeah, so I was just thinking, like, will UFC Vintage ever be a thing? I know it's a very niche sort of sport, fandom. But, um, yeah, just, just food for thought. And um, let's keep looking through these. Bunch of interesting stuff going on in the UFC right now. There we go. Voices of the Octagon John Anna. Can we get... An actual freaking rookie this pack? Mark Coleman? Vieira? Ooh, we get an upside down. They made it upside down. Alex Morano. Upside down. Ooh, we get a silver in the back too. I can see that. But there we go. So we do get a rookie here. And it says it's a photon prism, but I think that's just blue velocity. I'm like, yeah, that's what it says in the front. Exclusive photon parallels. I don't know, but uh, so yeah, there we go. Very cool. Looks very nice. Alex Morano. And uh, let's see what we got still to come. We have Chuck Liddell, the Iceman. We got Peter Jan, and we have a silver here of Alan, uh, bleh, Valentina Shevchenko. The women's champ and the security tag in the back. So that's interesting. Security tag, and we get this silver Valentina. Don't think these go for much, but man, 20 bucks. Pretty rough. We got one left. And uh, I'm also got some blasters here. I'm going to see. Maybe the blasters are better in a separate video. But all right, here we go. Last hanger. Last hanger. Only one single rookie card. All right, Giga, Yuri, Pantoja, Poirier. Oh, that's pretty cool. They got him doing the shoey in the picture. Ankalaev, Calvin Cater, Cannoneer. We do get a rookie here. Ian Gaddy, the Irish. Ian Gary. And uh, so nice. We do get a rookie here. We get Tai Tuivasa with the shoey. TJ Dillashaw, who was one of my favorite. Oh, we get an announcer. We get a Voices of the Octagon 
version, and it is Bruce Buffer with the voices of the Octagon. I got to sleeve that. Come on. Bruce Buffer, OG, looking sharp as always. And now in the blue velocity form, Bruce Buffer. I mean, it's cool. I'd take a, I'd take a rookie over that, but still pretty neat. All right, we get a no, they got another silver back there cooking, stargazing, John Jones, and a silver Dustin Poirier or Hollow, whatever you want to call it. And uh, that'll do it. So I don't know how we did there. I mean, 60 bucks, kind of rough, bit of a bit of a rough rip, nothing numbered, only one or two rookie cards in the entire three uh packs that's that's also you know that's kind of lame but at least we got a blue velocity one alex morano pretty off-centered but hey this is sick this is very cool again horrible centering but pretty neat bruce buffer and that'll do it everybody for ufc optic hanger packs Hope you enjoyed the video. Are you guys going to go pick some of this stuff up? Let me know. What do you think? And uh, that'll do it. Peace. DJ rips with his fingertips. He'll go broke by the end of this.